Step 1. Choose a professional grade shade to dye your hair to a medium to light ash blonde. If you want to add dark ash blonde hair color with highlights, you base color should be one shade darker to show through. Dot recommended shades. L'Oreal Major Professional Hair Color in Shade 901 Flash Lightest Natural Ash Blonde as a Base Color and Shade 901 else as your highlight color. If you dark brown hair. To begin with, you will need to bleach your hair at least two to three times as brunette hair lightens in stages. First it gets reddish brown, then orange, the brassy blonde, and then ash blonde. Therefore, do not expect to go from dark brown to ash blonde in one single application unless you are using a strong amount of bleach. If you have already bleached your hair once or twice and have gotten to a light brassy brown or dark blonde shade, use a 30 volume developer with your base color, and 40 volume developer with your highlighting color to achieve a stronger lightening effect. Ratio, one part of base color, one part of developer. The exact amount depends on the length and volume of your hair for short fine hair. One tube of each is enough for medium to long length of hair that has more volume. You may need a bigger tube or almost two tubes of each. Step 2. Following the with the mixing, begin applying your base color to the parts that are not to be highlighted. It would be best at this stage to take out the highlight sections and wrap them individually in aluminum foil. Dot for making things much easier, apply the base color to all of your hair for that day and add highlights a few days after that. Step 3. Apply the highlighting color to the individual hair strands you have taken out with the help of a brush or even a toothbrush. Wrap ideally in aluminum foil to trap in the hair dye and get in better results. You can also use cheap highlight caps to help take out individual hair sections for highlighting. Subscribe us for more hair growth treatments.